words. We don't need you anymore. We need Bloodborne. We need Bloodborne. And uh, let me update my stream tags too, because uh, we're definitely not doing soul level one. First playthrough. There we go. There we go. Oh my gosh. It's been like two weeks now. Hey, Grey Ghost. Good to see you, dude. Uh, so good news. We just finished Soul Level 1, Dark Souls 1. The unleveling run has been finished. It happened tonight. Oh, thanks for the hydrate. Yeah, air fryers are awesome. Oh, no worries, dude. No worries. Uh, I'm working on getting those last bits up to YouTube, but we did all bosses. We did all bosses on that game, and I'm so happy to have done that. Because I know I would have been looking back in the future and gone, nah, I should have just done it. Should have just done it. So I did, and I'm very happy. Very happy about that. Good to see you, dude. Hopefully you're having a great uh, Memorial Day weekend. Her weapon is a risk. We should probably repair that. I'm having trouble remembering where I was at, to be honest. Oh, I know. We took down Rom last time, and we got to the... Uh, um... Unseen Village is where we're at. It's your busy season? Gotcha. Gotcha. Well, hopefully you're able to get some kind of rest. Uh, here we go. Yep. Unseen Village. Hey, I appreciate the quick hello. Please take care. Can we get some hearts in chat for Great Ghost, please? Take care, dude. We'll lift you a cheers on the way out. Big cheers. All right. So I couldn't see that thing before, but now I can. And I have no idea what to expect around here. Oh. Hey, <laughs> that's my beer. Hey, that's my beer. But you're more than welcome to grab a pint and chill out here. Shadow, thank you very, very much for the raid. My goodness. We'll lift a big cheers. Welcome in, Raiders. My name's Uncle Wooly. Uh, I play Bloodborne on Monday nights. Wednesdays, I was doing a Soul Level 1 of Dark Souls 1. But we just had one boss left, and so I decided to do it tonight, and we did. Gwyn is down. Soul Level 1 has been accomplished. I can now join the ranks of Shadow, who did a Soul Level 1 of Dark Souls 3. So it's uh it's fun to be part of the soul level one, <laughs> the soul level one, elite, you know. And I hate to boost myself up, but my goodness, thank you for the hydrate. Uh, Sapiens, Ellipsis. Uh, who else do we have? Chicken Man, welcome in. Gibson, uh, Rocky Mount, uh, Clegane, welcome in. Also, Protect Me Cone. Welcome in. Welcome in, everybody. Uh, TSG BEJ. Uh, please correct me on pronunciation or if you have a preferred nickname or uh, preferred pronouns. And that goes for all the Raiders. I want to make sure you all feel welcome here. And I suppose I should probably introduce you to the puppy dogs. The Jack Russell on the left is Roxy. She's now 14 years old. And the Shih Tzu on the right is Lucy. She is four. Both of them are just infinitely more adorable and awesome than I could ever be, so people hang out for them, and they tolerate my mediocre gameplay, as referenced by the Death Counter, and just terrible puns, but welcome in, everybody. <laughs> I feel like I might need to amend the mediocre gameplay just a little bit after the SL1 stuff. 
But Shadow, you just got done streaming. Also, we need a ton of GGs in chat for Shadow because Shadow completed Cuphead today. So please give all the GGs you can. Uh, and you just got done streaming. So if you need to do any of the uh, post-stream self-care needs, hydrate, food, any of that, please, please, please take care of yourself. <laughs> Shadow, that is too kind. That is too kind. No, you. You are the coolest gamer because you did Dark Souls 3. I would argue that Dark Souls 3 at SL1 would be much harder. And I caught up with your VODs on uh, YouTube after I did my uh, SL, uh, not just SL, but just Dark Souls 3 first playthrough. And uh, I'm so sorry the amount of attempts it took to get through Dragon Slayer armor. That had to have been so frustrating. <laughs> it's so level 1, I just can't imagine. So huge GGs to you, not only for that, but also uh, also on Cuphead. My goodness. <laughs> Welcome in, Raiders. It's good to see you all. This is my first playthrough of Bloodborne. We just started, uh, we just switched games just a little bit ago. But if any of you need a raid and run, I totally understand too. I'm getting shot at from somewhere. This place is beautiful though. Yeah, I did not have fun with, uh, I mean, I'm just going to get to a safe spot so I can say hello. Uh, I did not have fun with Four Kings was really awful at soul level one. Gwyn is just hard anyway. Uh, Catlamite and Manus were awful. Uh, Manus took roughly 20 minutes just because of the damage output my character had. So staying alive against Manus for that long. It's just testing patience at that point. It's just, oh, it's so rough. Uh, I'm just trying to think of other bosses that were weird. Yeah, it took 20 minutes. So each like each run that got near successful was like almost 20 minutes long. Because <laughs> I, I was sitting down on Saturday. I went to stream. And I'm like, okay, I'm going to stream for like three or four hours. Typical stream length. Not a big deal. You know, it's a bonus stream for streaming on Saturday. And, yeah, because I got just so involved and so focused on the bosses and trying to beat them that we ended up streaming for <laughs> almost 15 hours. It was insane. Uh, thank you for the new follow, too, by the way. They're anonymous around here, so if you want to continue to lurk, feel free. If you want to ha hop and chat and say hello, you're more than welcome. And Beer Nerdery. Aw. Uh, Paint Seagull. Welcome in. Yeah, we love beer around here. I do a little bit of home brewing. Uh, we just switched over. Our first beer of the night was a Summer Honey from Big Sky Brewing. And it's a... I'm going to zoom in here for you. It's a bear with a, a surfboard. And then uh, we finished that when we finished Gwyn. So we've moved on to the fruit beer that's known as Pink Slit. And this is from Uber Brew. Uber Brew. Jeez. Maybe I need to slow down. <laughs> Uh, but this one's like a raspberry uh, fruit beer with a little bit of lime in it. Really good. Yeah, big cheers. Big cheers. I said it. Now I gotta do it. My goodness. You know what I didn't do? And this is... Uh, I know we're excited to start Bloodborne. But... I didn't do a boss tier list for soul level one and i want to do that while it's fresh in my brain and i also want to do it uh so i can compare how it was against my just normal first playthrough so sorry to derail but uh <laughs> at a non-alcoholic hefeweizen and now a sparkling water Ooh, that sounds tasty fa's are so good um depending on what kind of hefe too i I like the kind that have more of that yeast uh, spice to it because Hefe's get a little bit spicy where they kind of have like that clove, banana, sometimes even like a peppery character to them. Oh man, I could uh, I could sip on Hefe's all summer long. Those are so good. Okay, I just need to find where my other tier list is here. Bear with me one second. I think it was in... Oh, and I'm seeing Joe's picture of the bonfire. 
<laughs> this is bonfires for you. You can beat Gwen. Thank you, Joe. You're still hanging about. Book shower and join you all. I don't have any beer currently, so I'll have to join with Lil Wine. Hey. Uh, Wiccan Soup, uh, enjoy your shower and uh, see you soon. See you soon. Let's see. I think I had it in this channel. Here we are. Okay, that was the other games. There's my other tier list. <laughs> Bear with me while I while I find this. Having a coconut water and San Pellegrino. That sounds good too. My goodness. Uh, let's just. Uh, that's a little intense. Let's just get some other background music going here for you. There we go. <laughs> Has no yeast flavor, but. Uh, I can understand, you know. That's kind of what makes it <laughs> what makes it the alcohol. Let's see, where did I throw that tier list at? Bear with me one sec. Should have been more prepared for stream. Did it in general chat. I know it was right around Christmas time. Because it was right after I finished Dark Souls 2. Dark Souls 2 was an experience. So Dark Souls 2 took uh, 600 deaths. Uh, so level one, Dark Souls one took 397. We managed to do it in under 400 deaths, which uh, I'm very excited about. I was hoping to do it under the amount of my first playthrough, which was 353, but we didn't quite get there. Just didn't quite get it. That's all right. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Dark Souls born. Let me open this in the browser. And then we'll also get our just uh, the tier list. And categories. I know they have one for Dark Souls. Souls Remastered Bosses. Yep, that's the same one. Sweet. Sweet. Okay. Now that I have that all figured out, I can uh, share my screen with you all. There we go. So, bosses at Soul Level 1 compared to just a first playthrough. So, I would say, and this is just me, I'm not going to go in order uh, that I defeated them. Uh, and I'm not going to judge them also by like, oh, it's a tutorial boss. Well, I've already been through a playthrough where that part doesn't matter. But uh, Artorius is easy uh, S tier. And this one I had uh, S, A, B, C, D, F. A, B, C, D. Let's throw another row in. And row below. F. And what were our colors? F is blue. I don't know if that's that blue or if it's that purple. Nope, that's right. Okay. And I could be swayed by people who were through on the playthrough too. But, uh, I'm going to say, as far as it, it's going to be, uh, okay, it was fun. And challenging but not like oppressive i had fun against iron golem but it was kind of simple got it on first try i'm going c there uh four kings four kings was just a huge pain in my backside the boss run is awful uh the 
damage output versus spawn times is awful. We're gonna go D tier on four kings. Gaping Dragon, easy, nothing really to write home about. Um, first tried that one. I think Hitless too. I can't remember. Uh, that goes there. Seath we would have got first try, but uh, we had some of the crab friends uh, find their way in with us. So Seath, I'm going to go probably B tier. Challenging, boss runs not completely awful, but... Asylum Demon, Cakewalk, nothing special. Moonlight Butterfly, beautiful music, always... Uh, Always great music, but I always feel so bad after the fight, so C tier. Uh, you know the Grey Wolf has to go up with Artorias. Uh, always S tier for Sith. Gwyn uh, at soul level 1. Oppressive, aggressive, and A tier. For aggressive. Uh, very doable, but uh, really tries the patience. Uh, Manus, I have to go S tier. I'm going S tier for Manus. Um, other than just being a huge pain in the backside, he was good. He was good. Bet of Chaos, always F. Always. Capper Demon, where are you at? Where are you at, Capper Demon? Are you even on this list? There it is. Capra Demon F. Ceaseless, huge F. Huge F uh, in chat. <laughs> because I missed the cheese, which is basically only on the first playthrough. So I, or first try, I forgot about the, uh, the attack that you have to wait for and then run. Got killed by it and then spent, gosh, like 30, 40 some tries and then just ended up having to do it the the old-fashioned and difficult way which lasted ages ages <laughs> so uh ceaseless f tier f tier yeah uh taurus demon uh good balance had some scary moments um overall not too difficult i want to go b tier um i like the added challenge for this boss in in soul level Stray Demon. I'm gonna go C tier. Nothing too special. I think we did that one first try. Uh, Pinwheel actually got exciting on. Uh, Pinwheel actually got exciting on Soul Level 1. Hunters, good to see you, dude. Uh, so, Hunters, we did finish Soul Level 1 tonight. We did best uh, all bosses. And that includes uh, Kalamit and Manus and all the optionals, and uh, all we had tonight was Gwyn. So I wanted to get through it because I'm so excited to start Kingdom Hearts on Wednesday. But welcome in. Hopefully you're having a great Memorial Day weekend. Good to see you, Hunters. Good to see you. Uh, Pinwheel actually uh, got pretty interesting on this playthrough, so I'm going to go B tier. Sanctuary Guardian gave me a big bout of trouble but um uh, at, at this level it was a good challenge i would say eight here there won a team tournament for guilty gear nice can we get some ggs for hunters good work dude i don't want to clap too loud in the microphone just because it's <laughs> can get a little annoying for you guys i don't want to throw your ears out um ornstein and smo classic boss uh Got super sweaty. Uh, S tier for super sweaty. Demon Fire Sage was a pain. Can't remember if it was a first try or not. I think it was like a second or third try. But I, I think I've always liked the Demon Fire Sage just a bit more than the other, uh, like Stray Demon or Asylum Demon. So that's gonna go B tier. I don't like them, but I respect them in. You know, in the that rush of victory is just so good. Uh, crossbreed, um, I was not a fan of, 
on Soul Level 1 because of the uh, each hit was just so sweaty. You know, you get hit and it's like, oh man, I don't want to do this boss run again. Uh, B for crossbreed, not C. We're going to go Priscilla and B here. Bell Gargoyles, uh, first try, easy, easy clap on them at soul level one because I kind of knew more what I was doing. My weapon was upgraded a bit. Um, I want to go B tier there as well. Uh, Calamite, the boss run knocks it out of S tier. Uh, it is a really good dragon fight. It's not as good as Madeir. It's definitely better than Ancient Dragon. It was an epic fight. I was so angry at it. It might have been the most tries or near the most tries on a boss this playthrough. The boss runs awful. We ended up detouring to get the red tear stone ring and then we didn't need it anyway. <laughs> Because we didn't get knocked into the range on the uh, the final round where I beat him, so I'm gonna go A tier for Callum. Uh, just the whole thing with Goth and shooting him down and all that, I just love. Um, Quilag, I'm gonna go A tier. I really enjoyed this fight. It was a long slog, but what it did, it was that first boss of the playthrough that really put me into that. Oh crud. This is soul level one. I can't just tank through bosses the way I did in my first playthrough. And I can't just one try most of these bosses. So uh, yeah, uh, that one was a learning moment for me. And it was fun. It I was frustrated. It had all those like classic learning moments of fighting a, a souls boss for the first time. And it wasn't my first time. So I really enjoyed that one. Uh, Centipede Demon, C tier. Wasn't a fan. Hey, Apu. Good to see you, dude. Good to see you. We're doing uh, a tier list for the bosses of Soul Level 1 because I finished uh, the Soul Level 1 run tonight. So we're doing a tier list for them and then seeing how it compares to the non Soul Level 1 tier list. Uh, Nito, I'm trying to think. You know, it wasn't too bad. Once once I got the timing down and got the uh, the boss run kind of figured out again, and I had the Divine Club to get the skeletons dead. I hate to throw Nito so high as B tier, but I'm going to do it. And then Dark Sun Gwendolyn is just annoying, and then especially with low damage at soul level 1. Uh, Dark Sun at D. I think that's what we're going to do. I don't know if that's going to vary uh, very greatly from my uh, first playthrough. So let me pop this off screen just so I'm not doxing myself when I save this. And this is DS1 SL1 tier list. And I'm going to throw this in the uh, gaming chat section of the Discord. And if you're not a member of the Discord and you're, you know, not tired of just doing tons of uh, <laughs> tons of discords. Well, uh, here's my socials, which includes my Discord link if you uh, find yourself interested. It is a manual approval server. I like to keep our community nice and safe from spam and hate and all that fun stuff. So... Uh, if you do join, it is a manual verification. So once you approve the rules, I'll have to manually verify you so you have access. All right. So now if I go back, I'm going to go back to the uh, capture here, and we'll see how that compares between the two. And then we'll get right into Bloodborne, I promise. I promise. So here's Soul Level 1, right? Arcorius, Sif, Manus, and ONS. Then we have Gwyn, Sanctuary Guardian, Calamite, and Kulag. Seath, Taurus, Pinwheel, Fire Sage, uh, Priscilla, Bell Gargoyle, and Nido. Iron Golem, Moonlight Butterfly, Stray Demon, 
maybe we should just compare tiers as we go. So I didn't have Manus and S tier last time, but S tier is mostly the same. Okay. And then A tier, we had Gwyn, Guardian, Calamite, and Elag. I had four kings in A last time. That's interesting. Otherwise, it's mostly the same, except Sanctuary Guardian uh, was B tier for me last time. And we have C. I moved some up to B uh, in this one. So who wasn't in there before? Taurus Demon, Priscilla. Uh, Nito was down towards the bottom last time. And Demon Fire Sage, was that in B tier as well? Yeah. Interesting. Cool. I'll, I'll make sure both of those are, again, thrown up in the Discord as well. But uh, F tier stayed exactly the same. <laughs> exactly the same. All right. Now that I got that out of the way, again, thank you to Shadow at Noon for the raid uh, right before I went on my huge tier list uh, tangent. <laughs> Thank you for sharing your community over today, uh, Shadow. And again, big GG's on uh, finishing Cuphead today. Huge, huge GG's on that. Okay. One more. That's what you guys came here for, right? And Apu, hopefully you're having a good uh, Memorial Day uh, weekend. Good to see you. Back to the uh, Unseen Village. Back with Chianti. Ooh. We better do a cheers then, Wiccan. We better do a cheers. Let me uh, finish pouring this one into my glass. It's a tough thing when you have a 16-ounce glass, but uh, also a 16-ounce beer. It doesn't quite fit. Cheers. All right, thanks for indulging my uh, my tangent here. Okay. Yep, we're at the Unseen Village now. I don't like the all the undulating noises. Okay, yeah. Ooh, Bloodstone Chunk, that's what we need. Oh, I forgot. I don't have a shield in this. <laughs> Rom was cool. Uh, I think Rom took me, what, around like five tries or something like that? Maybe more? I'd say Rom was more annoying than anything else. This feels like bait. Ooh. It was. Ooh. Yep. I'm going to have to get used to this game again. <laughs> and especially the different healing system. Ooh, but the parries feel so much better in this. <laughs> Deontay? Is it the wine that tastes like pottery? Is it too loud for you guys? Let me know on game, game volume here. Feels a little loud to me. Duh. Aesthetics are cool, but gameplay not so fun. Yeah, his little uh, additional spiders are not great. Feels good to be back to Yarnum. Especially after having to parry Gwyn. Oh my gosh. Oh no, so we're starting Kingdom Hearts on Wednesday. Tonight, it's uh, Bloodborne. Dry red wine. Yeah, I notice for me, uh, I tend to be more of a white wine person, uh, specifically more on the sweeter side. If a wine is too dry, I just can't do it. Yeah, this is definitely not Mickey Mouse. Oh, what? How? You were dead. What? Yeah, 
Yeah, that's weird. Eno or cab, okay. Yeah, I usually don't do wine too often. But if I'm gonna go dry, uh, I actually am a fan of a dry mead. I'm going dry wine. Ooh, some cab, Cabernet Sauvignon. Nice. Wow, this is a boss combo. Or not boss, but a mob. the guy that's in front of me. There we go. Ooh, yeah. Nice dry ciders. It's tasty, depending on the time of year. Ooh, nice. What? Oh, there's one of those beasts. There we go. Get parried, son. Yeah, I don't like this. I am not a fan of this place. Oh, that's cool. Also frightening. Also frightening. Okay. Ow, dude, stop. Oh, now I got people back here. Oh, no. This is... <laughs> Who made this game? Oh. Miyazaki, what were you thinking? Out of stamina. <laughs> away, away. Oh, wow. This is something else. This is definitely a huge, uh, huge difficulty jump. Huge difficulty jump. My gosh. Well, my echoes were right there. That's pretty cool. Oh, so they constantly respawn. Maybe I need to go farm echoes. Or not echoes, files. Yeah, let's go farm some blood vials, and then we'll be back. I mean, that's true. I mean... But it is jarring, though. I will say this. It is very jarring to go from Dark Souls 1 <laughs> to Bloodborne in the same night. We'll see how far I get. Probably not too far, but that's fine. It does feel good to be done with Soul Level 1, though. That feels really good. What? Wow. There I was, thinking this area is safe. Oh, I'm just going to have a sip of beer. Nope. Can't do that. Not in Yarnum. Oh, man. 
When did my axe get so strong? This is awesome. I'm just wrecking. Oh, the moon. When the moon hits your eye. on pebbles. And that's okay. Should we hit these guys up? Ow, dude. these guys. You know, I should probably just waste a bottle or two. <laughs> uh, these aren't dogs. These are beasts. <laughs> Ah, we're net gain on that, so we're good. We're good there. Hunters, how are you doing? Uh, I think you're between semesters, right? Or are you doing any summer classes? Well, they do. They kind of behave like dogs. Yeah. I'll give you that. I'll give you that. Oh, I hear the crying. Which is what we heard when we... Uh, Defeated Rom. Oh, no. Can't one-hit these guys. session and we'll be full up on blood vials. Oh, just asking uh, are you doing summer semester for uh, courses or are you just uh, taking a break for the summer? Just asking how, how school's going. I wish I had taken more summer classes. Uh, but this Summer breaks were pretty nice too. Allowed me to get some more, uh, some more hours in at work when I was uh, going to college. And we do have an ad coming up soon for non-sub friends. So uh, taking a big break. Don't blame you. Do not blame me one bit. I don't know if I leveled up or tried to level up. It feels like I got a, a lot of blood echoes here. The sound they make is just awful. Ooh, wow. Four off of that guy. I'm 
maxed out on echoes. Or not echoes, files. Man. You can tell it's been a while since I played Bloodborne. I just keep uh, mixing up names on stuff. Alright. Ah, oh, this is a good game, though. It's a very good game. Oh, we're at that point where we need 20,000. Well. Oh, we need more bloodstone chunks for that. Oh, we got enough shards. We might as well level up our cannon. How does this cannon work? Oh, it must be like a primary weapon? No. Oh, we need 30 strength. We don't have that yet. Aha. But it'll be ready for us. We got some insight we can spend. <laughs> oh, we can now buy some of those with insight. Okay. Let's proceed. Now let's go back to the Unseen Village. And even though I say, like, uh, no backseating or, or things like that, the one thing I do want to do with this game, it's what I've been doing with all the others, is on a first playthrough, do all bosses, including optional. So if I'm at a point where I'm going to be missing an optional boss, uh, definitely let me know. Why did I just try to hold the shield? <laughs> Silly Wooly, you don't have a shield in this game. Yep, I did fight Parl. Because I think that's one that you can't fight after you fight Rom. This is locked? Yep, of course. Oh. But the run back gets worse. Gotcha. 
So are there really any missable bosses in this one? That you just can't get to? Hey, Max, thank you for the hydrate. And Prince Leo, welcome in. Good to see you both. Uh, Prince Leo, how's the move going? Hopefully it's going well. Always good to see you. Likewise with you, uh, Max. Uh, always good to see you as well. And Prince Leo, we continued the Soul Level 1 run to earlier tonight, and we finished it. And uh, it's in the books. All bosses, Dark Souls Remastered at Soul Level 1. Ritual must be stopped. Must we all become beasts? Ooh. Tomorrow will be last few things and we'll be 100% relocated. Heck yes. That's a that's a quick move then. You guys have done a, a wonderful job. I know it doesn't feel like it when you're moving, but uh, it worked. over here. There we go. Hey, thank you. It, it feels good to be done with that game. It really does. And I, I do have to thank everybody that donated to the charity stream that made that happen. Because I would have never contemplated doing a soul level one run if it weren't for uh, for that generosity so huge thank you how did that miss is there anything around here nope okay around there. Oh, I didn't mean to jump off, but hey, there's more stuff. <laughs> Just looking up uh, at chat. Aha, I see. Get out of there. There we go. Oh man, this is just so much faster. <laughs> uh, so much faster than Dark Souls. It's just so weird getting reacquainted with this. Your steps and I don't like it. Hey, that's hey. my beer. <laughs> that's 
That's my beer. But you're more than welcome to grab a pint and chill out here. Wobble Pop, I think I'm in a safe spot. I can greet you. Welcome in. Welcome in, Raiders. Hmm. How is Sinking City? I, I have purchased that game, but I haven't had an opportunity to play it yet. How is it going so far? Let me get you a shout out. And Raiders, my name's Uncle Wooly. I play Bloodborne on Monday nights. So Wednesdays, we're going to be starting Kingdom Hearts on this coming Wednesday. And Friday mornings, bright and early, we get up and play Final Fantasy games. Currently working on Final Fantasy V. Also, uh, well, if you got a drink near you, that's free. That, that, that works. Yeah. Uh, but if you haven't met my puppy dogs yet, Roxy's a Jack Russell on the left. She's 14. And uh, Lucy is a Shih Tzu on the right. She's 4. And both of them are just infinitely more adorable and awesome than I could ever be. So people hang out for them, and they tolerate the mediocre gameplay as referenced by the Death Counter. And uh, my terrible puns. But welcome in. Wobble Pop, how are you doing? How are you doing? How was your stream? And Wobble Pop, we completed the Soul Level 1, uh, Dark Souls 1 earlier tonight. Only bad gamers die in Bloodborne. Well, I'm trying not to. <laughs> but I died a lot in Dark Souls 1. Because only one of those is in Bloodborne. Otherwise, the rest of those deaths uh, tonight, yeah, those are in uh, in Dark Souls. And I've died 89 times so far in Bloodborne. Ow, dude, that is rude. Death Chamber. Oh, you beat until dawn. Yes. Can we get some GGs for Wobble Pop? Delayed death reaction there. What? Okay. This is strange. <laughs> Don't you dare look at me. <laughs> okay, I won't. I won't look, I promise. Oh yes, definitely, definitely. Take care of your uh, post-stream uh, self-care needs. And uh, thank you again very, very much for the raid. Thank you for bringing your friends over. Uh, have a wonderful night. Can we get some hearts in chat for Wobble Pop? Yeah. Have a wonderful, wonderful night, friend. Thank you again so very much. You raid over here um, way more often than I feel I deserve. So I, I feel... Uh, Enormous gratitude that you continue to uh, feel welcomed around here and bring your friends over. And thank you for the new follow, too, by the way. Uh, that is much, much appreciated. I'm just looking back to see... Yeah, Cran uh, Burry Bog. I, I saw your message about the coconut water in San Pellegrino, but I didn't see your name out loud. So, uh, Cranberry, can I call you that for uh, for short? I hear the bell. I don't see the bell. It's one of my favorite places to raid, and I trust you with my crowd. I appreciate that. Thank you very much, dude. Hearts and chat again for Wobble Pop. Nope. No, stairs. Stairs. Where did you come from? Wow. Okay. Okay, calm it down.
Oh my lord, this is too much. Ow! I'm dead. There's no way I'm living through this. How did I survive that? Grand works? Okay. I appreciate that. Thanks for letting me know. I always want to make sure people feel welcomed, and one of those ways is just to get your nicknames right. Okay. Oh, what is up with the lasers? Oh. Oh yeah, you're you're supposed to not get hit by that. Gotcha. Oh my goodness, yes. That is a sight for sore eyes. <laughs> uh back to the dream. Back to the dream, please. Take me back. Get me all the way back to a dream. This is way too chaotic. <laughs> I don't know if my heart can handle this. Very well, let me. Um, level. We'll go strong. Okay, we're at the Yargul Chapel. Wow, that just feels like torture. Like, there's no way you can go through there slow. If you try to take that slow one by one, you're just going to die. And also, Wiccan or or Cran, have you played FromSoft games in the past? Uh, which ones have you played? Uh, which ones are your favorite, if you have? I always like to ask uh, people's experiences, especially if they first time here. And Wiccan, I know I've seen your name before, but uh, I don't know if I've ever asked you that question. Uh, let's see here. And likewise with anybody that came over from any of the raids today. Ooh. I don't like those sounds. These get brought back because of the bell. So where's our bell? Where's the toll? Who's tolling that bell? I'm not asking who it, it tolls for, because I know. <laughs> Don't ask for whom the bell tolls. It tolls for thee. usually stick to turn-based RPG hey I feel you on that I'm a huge fan of, of turn-based RPGs
There we go. Get ourselves a little parry in. Ow, dude. Fine, if you want it that way, we'll do it that way. Any way you want it, that's the way. <laughs> I hate that the dogs are back. Uh, probably remember... Oh, from Lizzie or Leo. Okay. I'm like, I thought I remember the name from somewhere. And I appreciate the lurk. Uh, the lurks are always so very well. What I understand, too, is... Uh, I'm very much an introvert, so... Some days I'm not feeling very social, or I don't have the, the time or energy to... Uh, you know, be active in chat, so sometimes, you know, it's fun to just hang out, enjoy the vibes. Okay, did she revive anybody up here? Nope. Ow! Dude. So rude. So rude. We can parry a big boy, but he just needs to come up here away from the gun boy. There we go. That is what I'm talking about. Oh, yeah. I might need more blood vials soon. I say might. I Oh, well, there's eight right there. <laughs> That's wonderful. That's wonderful. Beware of Hunter. Oh! Hey! I know where this is at. Or do I? Yeah. This is Hypogean Gold, but that lantern doesn't work anymore, does it? Yeah. It was like I just right away, I was like, hey, how about that? <laughs> that was pretty nice. Yeah, I remember this place. I don't want to be here, though. This place was awful. What is that? Ooh. Why? Why? Nope. We're running from that, just like I did in the, the library. Oh, my lord. Oh. What is that all about? Oh, this place has gotten real funky since we've been here last time. <laughs> Oh, we painted ourselves into a corner. There's an elevator here now. Yeah! <laughs> oh. Okay. 
I think this is the least uh, calm. I mean, these games aren't calming, but this is the least calm I felt in one of these games. Okay, I know where I'm at now. So this is cool. Uh, so I've gotten that shortcut back to here. All right, so I don't feel so bad about going back down there. Had I not got that shortcut, that would have been a rough run back. And if we go back up, it looks like there's a spot that I can roll off here. Oh, no, maybe that was too soon. Yep, I think that was too soon. See the bottom of that. So let's see. There's that. There we go. That's what I wanted. That's what I wanted. Oh. The dogs in this game are the worst. I say <laughs> about those dogs oh what is this Keeper went. Keep an eye out for three spawns. Yeah, that's uh, nice and creepy. What? Yeah, I just don't know about this game sometimes. Ooh, more blood vials. Thank you. Oh, I parried it, but it was just it was too far away. Oh, stop. Feeling a lot less calm tonight. Okay, I actually want to go back to our other dream. Or the other lantern, rather. Um, I need to take a quick little break, I think. So bear with me real quick uh, while I do that. All right. Uh, I think just the unseen one, because we unlocked that elevator shortcut. And then we had that bloodbath thing. I don't even know what that does. I 
need to do, though, is remember to send the elevator back up. explore this area before. Oh, hey, dude. Oh, that's that's got to be bait. Yeah, that's too bad. Get him. There we go. Hey, Sky Pacer. Come in. How's it going? Hopefully you're having a good Memorial Day weekend. There we go. That's pretty nice. Hello, Sky Pacer. I better share the good news with you. We took down Gwyn, Lord of Cinder, to complete the chat GPT guided soul level one run of Dark Souls Remastered. of attacks at once. <laughs> so now we'll be on to, you know, less troublesome games on Wednesday, like, you know, Kingdom Hearts. <laughs> Been a nice weekend. Hope you're having a great one. Yeah, I'm having a good one. It's a really good way to cap off a weekend like that. Feels pretty good. Cap it off with a good beating of a challenge run and sleep well. I'll be honest, uh, Gwen kept me up. <laughs> Gwen kept me up at night. And uh, the other thing that kept me up was uh, I kept having nightmares that I accidentally leveled my character and that I had to start over. <laughs> That's what really kept bothering me. So afraid of that. Is there something down here? The sounds in this are just a bit much. Have you played Bloodborne before, Sky Pacer? I just don't feel comfortable going that way. I don't like going this way either, but at least I know what's over here. Oh, including my blood echoes. That's pretty nice. Yeah, how about you come up here? There we go. There we go. I feel like parrying is so much easier in this. Here we go. Actually, I've stayed away from all the demon or Souls games since trying Demon Souls. I like to watch. I am definitely not a pro. <laughs> 
Uh, but I can understand that. I can understand where they're more fun to watch. Um, how far did you get into the uh, Demon Souls? And were you doing the remake or the... Uh, or the um, the what's it's the OG. I don't know why that was escaping my brain. Ooh, ouch, dude. That's pretty rude. Oh, I'm out of bullets. <laughs> Helps to have bullets. There we go. Aw, that's too kind. That's too kind. Um, okay, there's that thing. Oh, yeah. Yeah, there you go. How about you start walking after me? That's good carry. Ooh, nice. There we go. Those things scare me, man. Ooh, another bloodstone chunk. We might have enough to level the axe again. I got the one that came out when PS5. Okay, so that's the remake. Got about a third of the way through and realized it was stressing me more than having fun. That is a fair assessment. <laughs> that is a very fair assessment, and I can't blame you one bit. What is that all about? Do I have enough to level up again. I'm trying to get these things to follow me so I can bottleneck them in the doorway. He coming. <laughs> there we go. That helps. Hey, Melly, good to see you. Good to see you. Welcome in. Uh, Bloodborne is going well, and uh, I did finish uh, Dark Souls 1, Soul Level 1. That does happen in Bloodborne from time to time. But Soul Level 1 is done. I can uh, just be done with it. <laughs> and for those uh, that don't know Melly, I know the auto shout out worked there. Um, go say hello when Melly's live. Melly plays uh, Dark Souls on Sundays, currently on her first playthrough. And she recently defeated Manus, so she deserves GG's. And uh, is very close to finishing the game herself. So uh, if you want to see more Souls action, that's uh, another place you can go. Let's just get up here. Ow, dude. Pretty rude, my guy. Same. Oh, we're out of bullets and we're low on vials. We might need to go farm for vials, I think. the way of this other one. There we go. There we go. Yeah, I don't want to lose all those blood vials, because we had enough to level up, but I don't know if I can get back there. Yeah, might be able to. Might be able to. Let's give it a try. 
<laughs> Starting to tilt. So, yeah. Yeah, Manus is tilt worthy for sure. Yeah, because I, I just did Manus on Saturday night. That was the last boss I needed before uh, the final boss. And uh, yeah, that was a tough one. That is a tough one for veterans or first playthroughs or, or any of it. It's uh, Manus is just a meanie. There we go. Give me one more. There we go. I need... Is there another one of these up here? Nope. Just that jerk. And I forget which way I went down. I went this way, right? I did not go this way. So I must have gone back down this. Oh, yeah, I went this way. Where am I? Everything looks the same in this game is the, the problem that I have. Please give me more bullets. Why no bullets? we go <laughs> um yeah it's very scary yeah that's nearly two levels i want to go spend that that is enough echoes for some good levels so let's go take care of that Let's go take care of that. <laughs> but hopefully you're having a good Monday, Melly. It is ghost. Uh, uh, I have English. I use words. It is so good to see you. But hopefully you're having a good Monday. Good rest of Memorial Day weekend. And I think we can drop down safely. Yeah. in a pool all day. That sounds like probably the best way to spend uh, Memorial Day weekend. I'm a, I'm a little bit a uh, little bit jealous. Okay, I'm a lot of bit jealous. That sounds like a really good time. Oh, that's right. There's a guy at the top of this, isn't there? Yeah, let's just uh, run past him. And his bullet-toting brother downstairs. There we go. Back to the dream we go. Out of this nightmare. <laughs> Out of this nightmare. And while we level up, I'll give you some puppy candy. Some puppies. Welcome. <laughs> what is it you desire? Very well, let me. Ooh, we had enough for two levels. That's what I like to see. Very nice. Ooh, ouch. Farewell, good hunter. Yeah, that, uh... May you find... That sounds like a real pain in the... I'm sorry. <laughs> I really am. That is no fun. I've done that before. That is really, really no fun. Uh, 
we need some more blood vials, so we're gonna do some farming. So Sky Pacer, this is uh, quite similar to the uh, Demon Souls remake in that uh, your healing items are consumables in this game. So you kind of have to periodically go farm for them. Unlike your Estus in, in Dark Souls. Or I guess your uh, whatever flask it is that you get in Elden Ring. It's kind of a pain. the bird. Oh, stop it. <laughs> Behave, you big burbs. Behave. One thing about this game, it, it has what they call the rally system, in that if you get hit, uh, if you can see the health bar, there's a moment where you have a chance to uh, fight to get more of that health back. So as long as it hasn't depleted from the health bar, you can hit enemies and gain some of it back. So it kind of helps. It very, very much incentivizes some, uh, some risk taking. <laughs> Ooh, he's smart. No, he dumb. Me too. I'm so used to Dark Souls where it just, you know, you get hit in the health and it's just instantly gone. Okay. Can we bother with the elevator and that farming? I mean, we could. Why not? I haven't been down that way in a while. We'll do some sightseeing. We'll do some sightseeing around Yarnum. Now that we have this beautiful sky and the moon to look at. This is a very beautiful game for how awful and nasty it is. Are they not going to roll the thing? Oh, there they are. There it goes. Heads up for non-sub friends, you do have an ad starting soon. All right, big boy. Remember me? This is an early area, so this is why I'm kind of able to kill most of these guys. Yeah, those guys are two. Now we're full up on vials, but I think I want to farm some bullets. So we're going to be stuck in this area for a little bit. I don't like the crying. It's kind of getting to me. The... Uh, baby crying. I always dodge and heal. Yeah. <laughs> so have you done a full playthrough of Bloodborne, uh, Melly? 
because I know you've done Dark Souls 3 and Elden Ring. And you're nearly done with Dark Souls 1. And you're going to Dark Souls 2 next, right? There's just a couple things I'll say, and this is very spoiler-free. Um, my take on Dark Souls 2 is be very, my very bands! patient with early game Dark Souls 2 is all I can say, is it, it gets better. Um, but early game can be very oppressive and quite difficult. So that's why I recommend uh, people that are new to Dark Souls 2, just give it a chance, give it a fair chance. Uh, Arthur, I got your bean. It is a juicy pear or booger. So we'll get your bean here. But in the mid to late game of Dark Souls 2 is where it really shines. It has some wonderful music, uh, some very memorable bosses, even though there's a ton of them. There's a few that really stand out, and there's some really, really good lore. So, um, yeah, definitely don't get discouraged by early game, because it's, it's a good game. It's just hiding. <laughs> it's a bit of a diamond in the rough. Arthur, here's your bean. Cheers. Ugh. Oh. That is way saltier than it needs to be. Hmm. They always get stuck in my teeth, too. Arthur, thanks. Thanks for the old bean. The old bean footage. Okay. Turn him. <laughs> what do you mean you trusted me? Wheelchair grandpa there is always good for at least uh, four bullets. So not only is it a good spot to uh, farm for vials, it's a good spot to farm for bullets. I think we should be able to buy some uh, back at the dream too. So. Hey, 17's good. 17's good. What do you mean you trusted me, Arthur? I'm confused. Oh, I, oh, the... Okay. Wooly brain is in full effect. Um, it just got washed in dopamine from finishing the, <laughs> the Dark Souls run. Oh. We just missed it. We just missed it. And I didn't mean to go to this one anyway. Let's see if we can go back there. Because uh, getting some... extra... chunks or whatever it is we need would be good. So those, like... Crawling mass of bodies is like the crystal lizards that you would see in uh, in Dark Souls. So we need one more bloodstone chunk. 
different. Common torch formed by wrapping a pine resin drenched cloth around the long of an end or end of a long stick. Long end of a stick. <laughs> Got two chunks. Let's upgrade our axe. That's good. That was a good mistake. By going to the wrong lantern. That's good. Very happy about that. Very, very happy about that. Oops. That's a bullet gone. Oh, we need six. Okay. Wait. Oh, we don't have enough. Okay. He's I swear I've played this game before. I mean, it's still a first playthrough. But. <laughs> um. Uh, there we go. Wait. I think the game's going to crash. It just locked up on me. Yep. <laughs> yep. All right. It's okay. Yeah, it's okay. We'll hop right back in. Okay, Sony. There we go. How about now? Yep. That is some nice good damage there. I only need two more chunks to uh, do the next level. Very nice. I'm hoping I can find another boss soon. Because it would be cool to at least get one boss uh, on Bloodborne. her jump too. <laughs> that was a very strange series of events. Oh, that, that's where we want to go. are just super rude. They're not obeying the leash laws of uh, Yarnum. Oh, 
she drops bullets too. That's good to know. Alright. If you are lurking, enjoy your lurk, Melly. It is always good to see you. Rapid firing my way through my bullets. <laughs> I need to not do that. And then I proceed to do it. <laughs> just continued to do it. <laughs> Emmy, enjoy your sleep. It is good to see you. I appreciate the lurk. Take care. Okay, that door looks like a way forward. I want to take my chances there, I think. Have to run past. Let me sneak right by you here. Thank you. Hey, Gold. Thank you for the resub, dude. Seven entire months of awesomeness. You beautiful human, you. Thank you very, very much for that. And you are streaming again Wednesday morning with some Final Fantasy VII Remake. You're in the slums of Sector Seven, right? I don't even know if I can parry these things. if I've ever seen one. Because <laughs> it was like out of a chest there too. It was interesting. Well, I've been this way before. Maybe I do need to be going that way. Dude, thank you very, very much. Can we get some hearts for Hegel? So this is uh, PlayStation 4 is the game, but I'm playing it on the kind of PS5. So that's the door I went through before. Yeah, just so more people can play it. Um, I know that a lot of people were hoping for a word about that at like the PlayStation uh, announcement. That's exactly what I needed. Here we go. Nope. Yeah, I got tangled in the camera. Is he stuck back there? 
Is he clipped into the wall? Oh, he's clipped into the wall. Nice. He's a glitchy boy now. <laughs> Can I still pick up the item, though? Nope. That's okay. That's okay. I didn't have to waste the extra bullets on him, so that's fine. Any, any plant is uh, part of a salad, then, then that would work. <laughs> but I usually don't cook uh, my plants in malt before <laughs> I eat the salad. But that is a good analogy. No, oh, no, no, no. That was stupid. Should have played it safe, but I didn't. Nope, not on Steam. Just uh, it's a PlayStation exclusive for now. It definitely is a lot of carbs for a salad. on them are just so erratic. Yeah, one of those charred wedge salads. Yeah. <laughs> That's it. Keep on lurk, probably go to bed early. Uh yeah. Uh same here. I'm not gonna be streaming for too much longer. Because I've already been streaming for what? Like five hours? Not counting the breaks of course, but yeah. I'm gonna probably end it earlier than I normally would on a Monday. Here we go. Thank you. Uh, I'm going to be riding that high all week long. <laughs> Guaranteed. Guaranteed. Why don't these guys give me bullets? But enjoy your lurk if we don't see you the rest of the night here, Hagel. Have a wonderful night. Can we get some hearts in chat? good friend Hagel and uh, he streams bright and early on Wednesday mornings from 5 to 7 a.m. Central so if you're looking uh, for a very chill place to wake up uh, that is a great spot to spend your Wednesday morning.
Take care, my friend. Always good to see you. And thank you again for seven whole heckin' months, dude. For you, uh, one of those Twitch shoutouts here. There you go. Let's play it smart this time. Playing it smart. <laughs> there we go. I don't like being things at all. What does that reach? I wish those things just permanently despawned. That hurt me last time I touched it. Ooh, hey. I need to look at these, uh, those runes. See how they help me out, because uh, I've just kind of been ignoring them. And that's not smart to do either. A lot of whispering. I gotta say, sound design in this game, even no matter how horrifying it is, it's it's good. I love the setting. I love. Uh, I do love horror games. Oh, this has got to be a boss. Okay, I'm doing a prediction here. <laughs> There's no way that's not a boss arena. Uh, yes, if you have faith, if I can do it on first try, and no, if you're a realist, you've been here before. If this is not a boss, we'll save the, we'll cancel the prediction and do another one for the, uh, if we do reach one. But this, there's no way that's not a boss arena. Especially under the moon like that. So the prediction is open. Feel free to throw away those channel points. Oh man, this setting is so hauntingly beautiful though. Really digging this game a lot. I just want to do. Let's, let's take that. Just a screenshot like that. Yeah, but that's good too. And a reminder too uh, our character is named after Wimpy's dog, uh, Rocco. So we are Odin in Dark Souls 1. We are uh, Rocco in uh, Bloodborne. Oh, that's a nice amount of no biddies there, or channel points, right? All right, let's go for it, I guess. Remember woman. Okay. action is usually when we see a boss. Mm, yep. 
that's not horrifying at all. Oh. Dude. I need a... Wow. One reborn. Dude. That's not nice. So, do I need to take her down? And then if I do, how? This feels almost like a fool's idol kind of thing mixed with a bigger boss. Bullets, that's nice. That's all of them. Oh, we could get up here from this side. Can we just sit over here and cheese it? That's me in the corner. That's me in the spot. Light. Losing to Bloodborne. That's an AoE. That's not good. hurts.
not on that tray. It's like uh, we had somebody who was smart. Probably Arthur. I bet it was Arthur. <laughs> All right. I'm thinking we definitely need some more vials. Let's try that again. Bullets don't really seem to matter. And I don't think bolt paper is going to be what we need. I think maybe we could try fire. Yeah. Uh, let's see here. Fire. We can spend insight for more bolt paper or fire paper rather. to get to the boss so let's just build up our inventory of healing items and uh, make another good run I think it's very possible see this one I don't think it was like as hidden that you had to take out number one the message helped but The other part of it is they were teaching you the whole way to that boss that you need to take down the bell ringers. So. Pretty intuitive. I just need to see how to attack the boss without just uh, getting stomped the whole time. Boss is very horrifying. Like, they really had some imaginations coming up with a lot of these bosses, especially the Bloodborne ones. Still remains one of the best spots to uh, farm blood vials. I'm confident we can get that boss and then call it quits. At least one more good attempt. I need to get good at just going, you know what? It's fine. We don't. All right, all right now. You're <laughs> overstimulated. Exactly. Let's Wendy. get some beer in you and then it's right to bed. Woohoo! Beer, 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 beer bed, 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 bed. Simpy, enjoy your night, my friend. Thank you for hanging in there through all of the uh, <laughs> attempts on Gwen. And uh, have yourself a wonderful night. Can we get some hearts in chat for Wimpy? And thanks again for welcoming our raiders to you with the, uh, the custom sound. Peace out. Enjoy your night. Big cheers, dude. One more time. We should have enough uh, vials. Have yourself a good week, Wimpy. That guy did not have a good time. My beans! Sword? Sword? It's so good to see you. 
but my belly is so full of beans already. The sword in my belly is already full of beans. <laughs> Welcome in. It is so good. How was your Monday? How was your Memorial Day weekend treating you? Hopefully well. Hopefully better than... <laughs> our character in Bloodborne getting attacked by those stinking crows. You worked? Oh no. I'm sorry to hear that you had to work, but hopefully you got some maybe holiday pay or anything like that. Let's get your bean. Let's get your bean. Unless he's going to attack us. Nope, he's going to attack us. <laughs> that sly dog. Okay, now it's safe. <laughs> now we can do a bean. Ooh, okay. It's been a while since we've had one of these. Pomegranate or old bandage. Sword. Tears. <laughs> oh. This is one of the worst beans of the bunch. Oh. Oh. It's nasty. It's nasty. Thank you for the bean. It is always good to see you. Um, where... Oh, there we are. That bean was so nasty, I forgot where I was at. I even forgot my own middle name. <laughs> All right. We just met a new boss in this game called the One Reborn, and so we're gonna work our way back there. I hope we can get on this attempt. Farming for vials is not fun. Sword, we uh, finished up the soul level one run tonight. Oh, oops. <laughs> I usually send the elevator back up, but I forgot. That's funny. That is so funny. Oh, we have a death there, don't we? That we do. And we finished up the Soul Level 1 run with uh, just under 400 deaths. So we were at 397 which is 44 more deaths than, is it 44? Yeah, it'd be 44 more than my first playthrough. And those 44 could have uh, easily not came from Gwyn or uh, Calamite or even Manus for that matter, but they did. 
So we're going to be starting Kingdom Hearts on Wednesday. Have you played any of the Kingdom Hearts games, Sword? these this feels like a long way to go for a boss fight super rude. Okay, let's let him get fully out there, and then we can just sneak right past. Yep, and then we'll do one of these. And we got a bullet guy here. And also one of his friends. And then we gotta get out past all of these bad boys. This is not a fun boss run. Oh, come on. That is rude. Oh, dude. I think that other uh, bell ringer died. shooting fire at me? Oh, there must be another bell ringer or something that I missed. Yep. Oh, can I do a plunging attack? Is that what I missed last time? Oh, yeah. Let's just keep doing that.
Yeah, it hurts, but uh, it also hurts him. like what he's holding there. When he gets knocked down, I need to hit hit him quite a bit. It's so difficult to target. Oh. There we go. There we go. Come on. Oh, so close. <laughs> All right. I know the strat now. I know the strat now. We can do this. I'll get this boss and then we'll call it quits. I should have just backed out. Played it smart. But he hits hard. Holy cow, does he hit hard. The bosses in this are just huge. I feel like the scale of these bosses compared to some of the Dark Souls bosses are... Uh, it's quite shifted. Because most of the Dark Souls bosses, there are a few large ones, but most of them are like semi-humanoid sized. But in this, it's just big, big beasts. 
So one could say Yarnum is, uh, you know, horrific beasts and where to find them. It's Yarnum. <laughs> That's where you'll find them. That's good. No, I didn't mean to do that, but that's fun. Pebbles? Nah. We don't need pebbles. Bloodstone shards, I need the vials. That's what I want. So tell me what you want, what you really, really want. The blood vials is what I want, what I really, really want. Thank you, dude. That's exactly what I want. Sorry, I'm annoying. <laughs> I'm the kind of player that when I play like Ocarina of Time, because you have players that just run through the entirety of Hyrule, and you have ones that roll the entirety of Hyrule, and uh, I'm the latter. <laughs> have a problem. I'm very well aware of it. Yeah, I think we can get down the next try. If I don't get hit by something stupid. hurts the most about uh, falling down that elevator is I lost about 30,000 something blood echoes. guys unless they drop something stupid like those uh bloodstone shards we should be good more. And while we make that boss run to give you a little bit of a little bit of that. Some sleepy sleepy pups.
can't remember if I sent the elevator back up or not. So. Oh, I guess I did. Nope, nope, nope. Nice. coming up for non-sub friends, so just a heads up on that. It's about two minutes uh, when that'll hit. Just uh, letting you know ahead of time. If we can get there with more flasks or blood vials. That would be super nice, too. Oh, no, 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 no. No, I don't want to summon. I didn't mean to do that. So let's, uh... Nope. We need to banish that. How do we do that? How do we get rid of, uh, summons? Did not mean to do that. Here we go. That's what we want. Yep, we don't want that. Here we go. Yeah, I did not want the summon. Here we go. And we do have an ad starting, so I'll wait till the ad's done before we get into the boss fight. So that way our non-sub friends uh, don't have to deal with the ads while we're getting into the action. Oh, my lord. My lord, indeed. Ah. Feels good to be done with Dark Souls uh, Remastered on Soul Level 1. I don't have any plans to do any challenge runs like that for quite a while. But we'll see. Uh, in the future I could could be open to it, but uh, for the time being, I'm gonna I'm gonna say no. Alright. Most of our friends out of an ad, we should be good to go. Attempt number three. I don't usually go this way, but, uh... Okay, that one did die. That one did too, excellent.
Yeah, that hurt a lot. Puking is no fun. Back up there? Oh, come on now. This is the attempt. Nope. Not unless I get a little too confident like that. There we go. Nice. Got him. <laughs> Sweet. That is a very, very good spot to end things. Very, very good spot. Oh, my goodness. That's a lot of blood echoes. We should probably go spend those. AJ, thanks for the GGs. Yeah, it's bedtime for me. <laughs> I'm just going to level up and raid out if uh, you want to stick around for the raid. Otherwise, if you're heading right to sleep, have a wonderful night, my friend. It's uh, pretty late for you. We get some hearts and chat for AJ. Let the echoes become your strength. And you weren't streaming tonight, but uh, you hung out here all night. So thank you very much, dude. Now shut your eyes. All right, strength and endurance. We're going big strong. We can use the cannon soon at level 30. And we're blood level 64 with Rocco. Nice. Farewell, good hunter. May you find your... Blood level 64. I don't know how many hours we are in because it doesn't say it on the screen. So, I wonder if it says when we go to load the game. I bet it does. Yeah, let's take a peek at that. While we take a peek at that, I need to give some shout outs to our raiders. Uh, we had three awesome raids tonight from Who Knows Yo, uh, Shadow at Noon, and also Wobble Pop. Thank you all very much for sharing your friends with us tonight. It was nice getting to meet new new friends. And also, thank you uh, big time for the biddies and the resub from Romo Dude and uh, the resub from uh, Hegel. Wow. You guys are too much. Too heckin' much. 
And thanks for hanging out for the uh, Soul Level 1. Uh, I'm gonna probably have trouble sleeping just because of how like adrenaline filled I am. But <laughs> Rocco is at uh, Blood Level 64, 21 hours into the game. Very nice. Let's uh, give you some background music. And uh, we'll uh, find somebody to raid out to. Reloaded here. All right, so our choices are. Let's see, what is SNES playing? SNES is playing Mega Man Legends 2. Uh, I'm avoiding spoilers, so unfortunately, I can't raid uh, Rare Gangster, who's playing uh, Tears of the Kingdom. Um. Mm hmm. Jess Capricorn's playing some Elden Ring. I know she's been working on a RL1 run. And uh, let me give you some puppy cam while I find somebody to raid out to. There we go. You can look at those adorable faces. Druids is playing some Dark Souls. Let me take a peek over there. Share the uh, the Dark Souls remastered love over there. Let's see if anybody's doing SL one. That would be really cool. or even a first playthrough. First playthrough, no, they're not speaking English. Yeah, um, I can't remember how I met ADH. Uh, druids, but uh, let's go over there. Let's go say hello. Let's go say hello. All right, raid messages, subs and non-subs. We got you covered. There you go. First one for subs, second one for non-subs. That's where we're gonna raid. Let me give them a shout out. That's where you can find us in case you get lost in the raid. Uh, again, a huge thank you to the resubs from Romo Dude and Hegel, the biddies from Romo Dude. Uh, our new uh, friends we met tonight, thank you for the new follows. Also, uh, the raids from Who Knows Yo, Shadow at Noon, and Wobble Pop. I better not forget to uh, copy that message as well. All right. That is going to do it for old Uncle Wooly tonight. He's going to go finally get some rest. <laughs> After uh, Dark Souls, Soul Level 1, in the bag, I did it. All right, I suppose I can kick off the raid, right? There we go. So until Wednesday, where we actually finally get a start, Kingdom Hearts, please take care of yourselves. Uh, stay hydrated. Don't stay up too late fighting Gwyn. 
for trying to beat the one reborn. You know, they'll always be there tomorrow. <laughs> Take care of each other, uh, seriously. And uh, big cheers, everybody. We'll catch you Wednesday. Have a wonderful, wonderful night. So thank you to Sword, uh, Chloe, Para, Haunted, all of those for the biddies. That those might be from Saturday. Thank you again. Thank you, thank you, thank you. We'll see you Wednesday, everybody. Have a good night.